All right, everyone, we are going to be solving this quadratic system. Um, there are two different ways that this can be solved, actually. I mean, we could solve this um, graphically or algebraically. We are actually going to solve this one algebraically, but I just want to show you what graphically would look like. If we were to have one solution, our line would just touch the parabola. Okay, if we were to graph this and solve it by graphing, our line would go through it twice for two solutions. And zero solutions would be where the line would not cross the parabola at all. Okay, so we're going to, though, solve this algebraically so we can see which type we would have. So that means we're going to be solving for both x and y. If you look at um, both equations, they're actually solved for y. So I am going to substitute x plus 6 in place of the y in the first equation. So I'm going to have x plus 6 equals negative x squared plus 5x plus 6. Now, since I'd like to have my squared term positive, I'm going to move everything to the left side. So I'm going to add x squared to both sides. I'm going to subtract a 5x from each side. And I'm going to subtract a 6 from each side. Okay, combine like terms on the left. The right side is just going to cancel out and have 0. So I have x squared. 1x, take away 5x, gives you negative 4x. Adding here, we have 0, so those canceled out, equals 0. Now, when we factor this binomial, I can just factor out an x. So I have x minus 4 here equals 0. Set each factor equal to 0. x equals 0 and x minus 4 equals 0. Well, this one's already solved for x, so we keep that. Add 4 to each side, and we get x equals 4. Now, these are our x coordinates. In order to find the y coordinates of each point, we have to substitute each value of x in place of the x in one of the two equations. All right, now, so since I have two solutions, this is what it would look like graphically. We would have two points where it actually crosses. So let me grab another color. We're going to first start with the 0, and I'm going to use the linear equation. So y equals 0 plus 6. Adding them, and we get y equals 6. So what does that mean? It means that the point 0 comma 6 is a solution. That point, 0 comma 6, is where two of the the two lines cross. The line and the parabola, excuse me. All right, now let's plug in the 4. So I have y equals 4 plus 6. Well, adding 4 and 6, we get y equals 10. So the second point where they cross graphically would be the point 4, 10. So our two solutions, 0, 6, and 4, 10. All right, have fun with these. <laughs> have a great day.